What's up guys? Back in the driveway, Jetta. Washed her yesterday, looks amazing right now. I forgot how good this color looks. Uh, my attempt today is gonna be, I'm gonna try to see if we can fix this. Now I have some leftover material and I'm just gonna kinda get, kinda get creative with it. Don't have enough for a full piece. Um, so I'll have to order that eventually in the future. But for right now, just so it looks better than it does right now. I'm gonna do some creative cutting and make this thing look at least close to 100% again. It's been a while, I haven't posted, probably about a couple of weeks. Uh, I've been doing the vinyl thing, had a guy come by with roof wraps, been doing a couple of those. Weather's changing, so if anybody's interested, they should do it now before it gets too cold, because I might have to uh, close up shop. That's what I've been doing. As far as the other cars, this car is still here. I just kind of feel bad about it. I guess I have a flat now. I guess I ran over something when I took it out last time. This one here is good. You may have noticed that the front carbon lip is missing. That was claimed by a curb and was taken away. This is the life of having a front lip. This would be my third lip now if I get it replaced. Uh, I might have to because the guys who installed it last time kind of put some self-tapping screws through the bumper, which caused it to, I guess, leave holes here. I don't know if you can see them. So I might have to get this covered up with another lip. Um, I do have a plan before it gets too cold for this one. Planned for right now is to wrap a half wrap. I have some satin black left over and I want to kind of do this half satin black. Leave that white for now. I probably have some sort of design here, but that's going to be coming up next. Kind of blacked out here. Not sure what I want to do about the trunk, if I want to cover that or if I'm gonna leave it as is. Some days the sun hits just right and it looks amazing. So I think I wanna leave it as is. But yeah, I wanted to practice doing partial wraps because it's kind of popular right now and it's a good way and a cheap way if anybody's interested to get a new design or a new look on their car. But I guess maybe we'll start on that one in the next video. Probably just gonna cut this strip out and then lay another piece in. As for this one, probably cut along, try to get close to that body line as possible, all the way to the edge of the door, and lay another strip here. And then as for this, this one will be a little bit tougher, but I'll have to cut here and right here, and then do another piece right there. So yeah, I'll be ordering a 30, 20 to 30 foot piece in the future to replace this whole side, because I kind of want to redo the quarter panels I did them on the Lexus on the last video, and those came out way better than these. And, you know, that just comes with uh, wrapping. You learn a lot more the more you do it, so I definitely want to redo it on this side. All right, so I made my very light cuts here and here somewhere. Um, you want to be very careful cutting on the vinyl. Don't want to cut too deep and hit the paint. But we do want to take this off. Go slow. You want to see if there's any damage through the paint. Let's see. Let me see that. All right, so in this case, the vinyl actually did protect the paint, so we're okay. We're gonna take this piece off all the way to here. See, there's a very tiny line I made. So let's peel this off. And again, just take your time. You do want straight, straight cuts. That way the seam is pretty much invisible. Side up. All right, this one might need some help getting started. Let's see. Basically how to do that, just hold one side with your fingernail and then just pull up to get the cut started. back now I, I cut it to the corner here because I didn't want to interfere I could have gone up here but this would have interfered with the top layer roof wrap and then I'd have to worry about sticking it back down and all kinds of craziness so we just went to the corner and there we go all right that gave perfect 
And once you cut off the damaged parts of the vinyl, after that, it's just a matter of cleaning it down and then using some knifeless tape, running it on. I mean, that's the hardest part, is just getting the cuts right. This is gonna look a lot better. Let me go get the material and my, I hope I have some knifeless tape left. I should have some. All right, as for cleaning, I just like to use a microfiber towel. All right, knifeless tape is on. You want to get the filament kind of close, but overlapping the vinyl that's already there. For this side to get it to match, I am going to run another knifeless tape here along the bottom. And we're going to pull that one first. Got this nice little piece cut out. This is where we're going to lay it. There's the other knifeless tape I laid in. All right, let's put it on. Knife this type is off. Nice improvement. Uh, the bottom here matches. What you want to do, if you're doing this, just remember to hit the edges, edges of the vinyls that you just laid down, just hit it with some heat, just to make sure nothing happens to it or starts to pull up or you're driving and a wind catches it and starts to lift, then you have to start all over again. But I think that's good and looks a lot better than all that. Door's done, quarter panel is fixed. I gotta JB weld my fuel tank door again. Looks a lot better than it did. Oh, uh, I think I might have enough for the fender. That's gonna be a tricky one, so we'll see. Oh, and of course to all my new subs, uh, thanks for subscribing content will be flowing more frequently just had to take a week off and address some things but uh, I am doing the rap thing and if that's what you're liking if you like the content of these videos I am doing more Jetta stuff I am gonna be doing more Beamer stuff so stay tuned and that stuff will just keep coming so uh, thanks for my new subscribers let me get started on the mirror cap and we'll finish this up Just finished up the mirror cap. Looks good. This side looks good. I'll fix that. Here, we could just, we'll just put that right there for now. Yeah. Took a little longer than I thought. I definitely need more practice, but I'll just come with time. Should hold until I get another roll in. Then, uh, saving money for more parts. 
still waiting on more parts for this and some suspension goodies for this one. Nothing crazy. It's more of a maintenance situation where I want to do the control arms on this one. But then, of course, the half wrap is coming soon. For that, I think it should start right here on the door handle. Then kind of right here, go across. And then all of this will be set in black. Stay tuned for that, that'll be in the future. Uh, again, I'll be trying to pump these videos out a lot more frequently now. So, especially with the weather being the way it is. So, that's all I got, guys. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my day. You guys do it too. So that's it, guys. Give this video a like and subscribe for more content. Peace.